Hello everybody, NCS here, and welcome to Bloodstained Curse of the Moon. I was intended to play this game or stream this game yesterday, but uh, there was some Linux update or something that caused OBS to not work, and uh, I had to fix that first. It, it was great. <laughs> anyway, it, everything seems to work now. And uh, this game even seems to work on Linux, despite not um, having an actual Linux version. Except for one part, which I cannot get to just yet because I'm not in the actual game, huh? Uh, I haven't played much of this yet because, uh, well, I tested it, so I can see if it works on Linux or not. Hey, Bea, how are you doing? But other than just the first level, I haven't actually played too much. I think all the did I ever uh, go into the options? Apparently I did. Uh, can I get out of here again? Oh dear! <laughs> Please don't uh, change the position of the window. Okay, I cannot get out of here with my controller, uh, which is because my controller is mapped to buttons. I uh, mean to keyboard buttons, and apparently I didn't map escape to anything. So, <laughs> oh well. Yeah, let's... There we go. Oh, uh, yeah, let's delete my file. It's from the first stage, as you can see there. Stealth veteran? Can, can I change the stealth smell? Huh. Uh, I cannot choose delete. Oh, God. Apparently, I need to remap some stuff on my controller if I want to use the menus properly. Anyway. Ah! Under certain conditions, uh, thanks for telling the conditions though, game. Oh well, let's go to... oh my. What is casual? Easygoing style, ups and unlimited in taking damage will... not... Not back? What? But, 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 but that's Castlevania! You cannot just get hit and not get knocked back. There is no penalty for selecting the star. I sure hope so! Outside of, you know, an easier game. Well, which isn't really a penalty or anything, but, you know. Now, let's just, uh... Start in veteran style. I mean, I'm... To be honest, I... Didn't play the... Castlevania games, the classic ones, until, like... Five years ago or something? Uh, anyway, we have, uh, an entry, so let's do that first. I have more time to talk about nonsense later. <laughs> there was once a man who had been given the moon's curse by demons. That man was Sangetsu. Wrapped in crimson garb with eyes like fire, he relentlessly pursued the demons who cursed him. As he journeyed from one pit of darkness to another, he would stop at nothing until he struck down every last demon in his path. One night, he sensed the looming presence of a great demon. He swore to eradicate all demons, no matter how much of a threat they posed. Bathed in moonlight, he cried out as he drew his sword, which consumed the darkness from within its wretched steel. On that night, a cat started meowing below my chair, which meant that either the demons or the moon itself would feel the wrath of his blade. I didn't know you had that power up there. It's all thanks to you. Yeah, so, uh... My, uh, my first Castlevania game was Symphony of the Night, and, uh... I loved that game. So much so that I had problems getting into the classic games. Like, I think I played one classic game sometime after Symphony of the Night, and it felt so different that I couldn't really play it. So yeah, like, I mean, compared to Symphony of the Night, the classic games are stiff as hell, you have to admit that. But nowadays I actually do like the classic games, even if I'm not playing them too much. Like I think I've played them once and beat them, and since then I haven't touched them. Which doesn't mean that I don't like the classic games though. 
Except for that they are a little bit too stiff. Like, even though this game here is uh, mirroring how the classic games played, this game, from the little bit I've played of it, feels a lot less stiff, if it, if it makes any sense. Can I help you somehow, Bea? Also, always check the walls for wall chicken. I think I found a breakable wall when I played, when I test played this year. Don't remember where it was, though. Also, it's kind of weird that uh, hearts in this game aren't actually for use for your sub weapons, but uh, for your life. <laughs> I mean, it, it would make more sense if Castlevania hadn't taught us to uh, consider hearts as ammo. Also, I have no idea how to get through there. Do we have a slide? No. Uh, that was my sub button. Yeah, sub weapons aren't on up and attack either. They're on a separate button, which I welcome. Makes it a lot more, well, not necessarily more sense, Ooh, like, but, uh... I mean, we have more buttons now, so might as well use them here. They teach us about the sub-weapons. They acquire weapon points. Oh, now Star works all of a sudden. It works, Star or my controller works for nothing except for this? <laughs> uh, that's weird. Ten, we already sub-weapons, okay? That lamp didn't contain anything, except for FIRE! Okay. So it only shoots if we are actually on the same height, that's interesting. Yeah, just like in- ooh, sweet! In, uh, classic Castlevania games, you can only jump if you've already started moving. And, uh... Or rather, if you press forward and jump at the same time. But you cannot change your direction mid-jump, or start moving mid-jump. You have to move to begin with, so if you jump, you better know where you want to go. No turnbacks. Also... Alright, I, uh, the, the first sub-weapon I had was some kind of magical thing, and I, I just got a whip. Okay. Uh, the whip attacks diagonally upward. So that might be nice. Although I think 9 times out of 10 I'll still just use my sword, like, jump and attack instead of using the... the whip. Here, the whip would've been good for, though. <laughs> Anything? No. Gotta be careful, though, I'm, uh, quite a bit short on life. So I, I, I'm guessing we need another character to get through here, huh? Through these small gaps. Like, we we opened up a gap earlier and we couldn't get through, so... Right, and now we have this attack back. Which might be good if I actually uh, get close enough. There we go. Like this. Nice. Wow, it takes three weapon energy, really? Huh. Better be careful not to use all of our weapon energy. We probably need it for the boss. And you probably can't duck below that fireball that thing shoots. Actually, is there anything to the right? No. Okay. Okay, um, I'm gonna guess that this mini-boss here is gonna be pathetically easy. Yes. So that's a huge plus, you can use your sub-weapons from, uh, from on top of stairs, unlike the traditional Castlevania games. <laughs> Nothing to the left, okay. What is this dude you're doing anyway? Is he just... Background decoration, but why is he shining them? Like, I want to have your pickaxe if, if that's what it is. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, nice. Just what we needed. I did take a lot of hits. Uh, I think we're right in front of the boss now, too. Let's see if there's anything else in. Yeah, okay. Didn't think the crates would be openable or anything. Um, let's not take it. I think it was useful, but let's not take it. Yeah, this is uh, as far as I got to this boss here, and then I stopped. Okay, so he cannot hit you standing all the way back. That's good enough. Sweet, that actually does it! I did not know that. Yeah, so I'm assuming you're supposed to... Uh, right. I forgot about this part. I'm assuming you're supposed to, uh... Just stand here and attack him with a whips-up weapon, but... Or with your sword. Uh, I prefer to not miss with any sub-weapons. Can he not hit you all the way back here? <laughs> nice. Gotta memorize that, eh? Mm. Yeah, I probably should have taken the whip after all, huh? <laughs> yeah, he cannot hit you from here. Wow. Safe spot. I mean, it is the first boss, so... Still seems weak. And of course I'm gonna use the safe spot, now that I know of it. Uh, I think his hand should hurt you too, if it actually reaches you. I do have to say, so, though, that I... Ah! Red. That I, uh, like the sound of the boss music here. No, there we go. I was just missing one hit. Oh, or... We have phase two. Okay. Uh-oh. Holy shit! Oh, that was just his, uh, final... <laughs> okay! Uh, thank goodness I had as much life left as I had, otherwise I would have died to this... To this noob trap. <laughs> that wasn't a nice game. Or maybe it cannot kill you, that's also possible. Maybe it always leaves you at exactly one. Where are you, though? Oh, it's, yeah, it is. It's the protagonist of uh, Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Uh, oh, I need to press start, okay. Miriam has become an ally! So, from what I've heard, just like in Castlevania 3, you can switch between party members. LB and RB buttons. Okay. Okay, so everybody has their own health bar, which is nice. I think, I think Castlevania 3, you shared one? Okay, so you have to be careful who breaks the lamp, so you uh, don't, like if you like a weapon you probably shouldn't just break a lamp with just anybody. Wow, that's a fast switch, Not even mid-air! 
Ah, uh, but you cannot use it to uh, to stay in air. Like you can't use it to stay in air forever, apparently. Like, ah, uh, no. This since the backward doesn't move, it doesn't seem like any projectiles would either. So, huh? You can't just jump over a projectile without that slow enough. Okay, so Miriam for some reason has the whip, okay. She's a high jump. And a slide! Okay, so that's how we get through the... Those low areas from before. And yeah, of course, we had to have a character with a whip. <laughs> I mean, it's a Castlevania game, so of course we gotta have whips. Except it's not a Castlevania game, it's bloodstained, but you know what I mean. Uh, we cannot go back to an old stage, it seems. So we cannot go through the small passages. Maybe there is a new ba new game plus. Okay, so we have a dagger that costs one, or we can have triple da- ah! Upward daggers that go up. I mean, Miriam's range is so large anyway that I don't think she needs the daggers, the normal ones. So it might be good to have something that attacks uh, upward. Also, didn't uh, Sengetsu say everybody has their weaknesses? What is Miriam's? So far, I can't see any reason. Like, okay, Miriam can jump higher. So she can more easily attack high guys, but... Well, maybe that is a weakness that if you just want to do a short hop, you can't. I don't know. Well, I guess Sengetsu's sub-weapons are slightly better. <laughs> Yeah, like right now I can just <laughs> deal with those guys like that. Hmm. Not quite. Uh, not at all. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's a new sub weapon. What did I just get? I'm assuming that was just points. Anything to the right? No. Always check all the walls. Maybe there is another passage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you cannot jump off the stairs at all. And I'm kind of afraid of using... Uh... Oh, is the weapon energy shared between characters? It looks that way. Yeah, it is. Huh. That is interesting. But, um, I know the arrow's pointing up there, but, uh... Is that just the old stage again? Or is that a new...? I'm not actually sure. Okay, what, what exactly is that? Angry mode! Good! Now, I'll take that. I'm assuming that, uh... Okay. That uh, wep uh, that sub weapon deals more damage. Okay, I think I want to have a whip against the shield dudes. Single dagger, nah. I don't know. Should I go the other way? I mean, there were arrows pointing there and all that. So I feel like I should go there, and uh, so I guess I said he always takes the shortest path, and that, to me, appears to be the one where the arrows are pointing to. Hmm. I guess I just have to play the game multiple times, huh? Uh, let's ignore that path. But I'm curious! I don't think I can go back through these doors, can I? Screw it! Executive decision. We'll take the long path. And maybe recruit another ally or something along the way. Now I wonder though, do you lose a life when one of your characters dies, or do all the characters have to die? Because that would make sense that um, there is multiple passageways, like one in case Miriam dies. 
and you don't have her back yet? On the other hand, that would seem like a dumb move. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, that's... NICE! We got the axe! Eh, uh, the axe. The, the... Well, it is an axe in this case, but we got the, uh, the, the HOLY CROSS! Also, oh, these things here are relentless. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> oh god, giant bats! Um, Crap! Who'd have known the giant bats are my worst enemy? Uh-oh. Yeah, let's switch. <laughs> Sangetsu, I need you! And a better sub whip for you, that I'll also need. Which is fine, since we are having... Nice, the good sub weapon. Don't jump. And now just to uh, see that the door led to this area here as well. That's my guess anyway. Uh-oh. I need the whip! Or the triple knives. Uh oh. That's bad. Run! It's flea men! Except they're toads! Uh, never mind that. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, yeah! The character stays dead. Oh. That's awkward now. Oh my. At least both of them get revived. And I'm back down here and have lost all of my sub weapons. No! I didn't want the whip! Considering that Miriam has a uh, whip as her weapon here, I'm going to assume that Miriam will also start out with a whip in uh, Ritual of the Night? Did she have a whip in the demo? I don't remember. It's been a while. Either way, I'm really looking forward to um, Ritual of the Night coming out eventually. Probably should have kept that for uh nice dodge for Sangetsu. Uh oh. I'm going to pretend that all of that wasn't was totally intentional. Ah crud, that should have been Sangetsu's weapon. Crud, that was not what I wanted. I wanted to jump off, but yeah, you, you can't jump off of stairs. I'm a fool! Just slightly. Oh well, I'll need the sub-weapons. Or rather, I'll need the triple knives. Assuming I hit as well. Oh dear. THERE'S TOO MANY FROGS! Oh god. RUN! <laughs> you can do it, Zagetsa! <laughs> and he did it too. Good lord. Uh, I need that life. Uh, that's what I wanted, but I'll take it now, I guess. And that's probably where the other path leads, uh, or ends up here. I would guess. But I want to take the long path. I cannot detect downward.
Okay, so I'm guessing the attack speed is actually a lot faster than Miriam's. So that is a notable difference. Give me something better than a knife. I'll take that. I mean, three knives is better than just one knife. You cannot deny that. I don't care about points, I just want you dead. Or is that possibly where the other path would have led to? Huh. Maybe there was another split in the row. Who are you? Yo! Oh shit! I panicked. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, oh, no! Ah, crud. I'm sorry, Miriam! Ah. That didn't go well. That's not going to go well either. Uh, goodbye, second life. I hope you have infinite uh, continues, though. Anything else would be, uh. Not unfair, but rather unfortunate. Although, even the classic Castlevania games gave you infinite continues, didn't they? Nope! <laughs> Wrong sub weapon. Okay, that is awfully nice of the game devs. Give you just the right sub weapon for this part here. Assuming you collect it with Sangetsu, otherwise, uh, you're kind of screwed. <laughs> How do we get that? No, honey, Miriam! Why? Uh, I'm assuming that is, uh, like, total MP refill. Or weapon energy refill. Can you open it from the other side too? No. Okay. So I'm assuming you cannot revive your fallen characters at all, can you? I'll keep what I have. Yeah, I shouldn't have kept that. <laughs> okay, I'll take the whip. You convinced me. Uh-oh. Not liking the icicles at the top there. Is that a turtle? Except for that... Demon top, I, I guess. Uh... Okay! <laughs> Didn't know I was fighting a shoot up boss! <laughs> Ow. Ow! Okay. Yeah, expect me to die at least once, uh, trying to figure this boss here out. At least once. <laughs> but now I have my characters back, so that should help. Yeah, these old bosses... We're always, uh... Is that a single knife? I don't remember. Must have been, yeah. Actually, I never opened it with anybody but Sengetsu, huh? Yeah, the, these cast old Kazumiya bosses were always these, um... You have to find out how they work. Before you can actually deal with them. And I like that kind of game design. You don't always have to do everything on your first try. Reward people who like to strategize or who are good at dodging, good enough that they can uh, dodge long enough to figure out uh, a pattern and then deal with the enemy by exploiting that pattern. I like that kind of game design. Of course, things have to be uh, avoidable to begin with. Ah, cool, I got an extra life, nice. Like, this boss seems like a boss where avoiding is rather difficult, unless you already know the pattern, but, uh, you know. Ooh, that is max weapon energy up. Nice! Wait, does that mean that I've missed a max life up? Ah. Huh, he has more life? I didn't realize that. Well, that's another... Weakness of Miriam, then, huh? Uh, 
what's in here? Ooh, nice. Okay, the other one's the whip. Right, I'm, I'm assuming both of these cattles, uh, lamps, I mean, have the exact same thing inside there. That was pathetic. I'm, uh... Not gonna enjoy this now. <laughs> Got to duck. Wow. Uh oh. Good, I didn't actually need to jump on top of there. Okay. So three of them come down, then the girl comes down where I am. Nice, the axe is super effective against uh, that boss here. That's nice. Probably should. Save some of my weapon energy, though. Okay. And I'm out. Hmm. They were standing right in front of that boss that uh, then can swing at it. But it's shooting the stuff at you. Okay, no, it's invincible during that. I mean, that was to be assumed, but, uh, you know, gotta try it out. Yeah, Miriam's range is really helpful here. Also, I'm assuming the bubbles will fly at you... ...eventually. Oh, I won't find that out. Yeah, th I'm assuming that pose is where the... NICE! Yeah, where the bubbles would have sh been shot at you. Ah! I'm assuming I didn't dodge that, and, uh... <laughs> I don't even know if you could dodge that, though. Like, that seemed rather undodgeable. Oh, well. Hey, another friend. Hello there. Ooh, Alfred! Nice. Sweet, Alfred has become an ally! Nice. Okay, so now, let's see what his stake is. Okay, we know that already. Uh, I mean, that is exactly the same thing we've bet before. Ah, I'll follow the remains of one went to lead me to the right direction, so that though that's what those skeleton dudes are doing. And I guess... Uh, Oh. oh yeah, that, that was all uh, the same as before. Pathetic uh, melee weapon, just like Cypher. Alchemy. In other words, super powerful magic, just like Cypher. <laughs> wow, that attack is even slow as hell. <laughs> yeah, so... Huh. Okay. I just noticed the um, different paths at the second stage. Like, yeah, that that's probably a rather accurate uh, it's rather accurate of how it actually uh, goes, you know. That's just that's just the fireball. Hmm. Yeah, old man, you are garbage in <laughs> the actual melee combat fighting. Let's use somebody good instead. 
He's sad as he got whacked by an enemy immediately. Hmm. How did I attack these dudes to begin with, without getting hit? Huh. Okay, so what is that? Is that... That seems like duplication or something. Okay, we have two Alfreds. Yes, we do. We have Ray. Yeah. Good. I know I like duplication. I think I'll keep that. That's sad. I don't need duplication to defeat that dude. In fact, for range, I can just take Miriam. But I don't think that the... Ah, crap. I don't think that the fire wheel is all that much better. Didn't mean to use that, but okay. So that dude uh, means that we should go down. Well, let's, uh... Oh. I'm not getting through there! Forget it. <laughs> Unless the fire wheel actually, uh, uh... Don't have that anymore, though. There's no way I'll get down there with the uh, current setup. Well, I screwed up. Let's go somewhere else, then. I didn't mean to fall down there. <laughs> well, let's not take the other... Up weapon then. I somehow expected the cat to jump at us, or I don't know. It, it seems like it's not even. Well, what am I saying? Oh my God! They explode. Okay, you're telling us to go down. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do everything you say. You know? No, they're there. Are they color coded? Probably not. Could be, though. Although one of them was green, wasn't it? We don't have a green. Or does green just mean. whatever character? I don't know. I'll figure it out eventually. Gotta love the Holy Cross. I kind of don't want to act with that, though. Almost. I could really need some four hearts, though. Ah! Oh. Okay, so he doesn't change sides anymore. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, Zangetsu definitely needs a new one. Much better. Do you want to go up or down is the question, though. Yeah, no, that was dumb. <laughs> I wanted to figure out if it's one of the shoots. Oh. There's cats in it below me. <laughs> if that one was one of those shoots indefinitely guys or not. I didn't even find it out, it just died. <laughs> and all of my characters are really low in HP, so that's not helping. That went surprisingly well though. Ah. Okay, so the Holy Cross does not have unlimited range. Can I hit you? I can. And now let's find out that up there was nothing but health. Nope, there is another path. Cool. Probably a shortcut too, from the looks of this. Are those? Yes, they are. <laughs> Mimics! Why? Uh, I'm actually fine with my current setup, but let's take a look. Ah, that could be good. It definitely is good. Crap. 
I don't trust the looks of that. Give me a counter. Yeah, it, apparently that sand falling down there is just uh, part of the atmosphere. I needed. Oh fuck! Yeah, that uh, <laughs> knockback. They gave us a chance. I declined it. All right, your jump is nearly as high. You know, I'm starting to regret not taking the whip. No! No, don't, don't even ask. <laughs> Wait, but... She's got another axe too? I am never gonna use that, forget it. <laughs> that thing is way too slow. It probably is really satisfying to hit without the... Oh, right, that was just health. Oh god, I'm, I'm definitely using it over this, this pit here. And I probably don't have enough uh, yeah. No flames. That's gonna suck, huh? What's that? That is ice. I cannot use ice with just three. Oh, wow. That is... That bat is going to kill me. Okay, it's a nice, it's a magical sword, but uh, I completely missed with it, so now I'm dead. <laughs> I killed the bat, though! <laughs> ah, shit! <laughs> Can I get another weapon, please? Oh. Are they random? Or do they cycle? I'm not getting far, am I? <laughs> also, have I ever died? Uh, without either being the last character who dies, or uh, without falling to a pit? I think I'm going to keep the flame wheel. Okay, so that symbol was. Okay. Hmm. Nuts. Well, at least the knife only takes one sub weapon, so that's good. Ooh, another life. I'm getting lucky with these, huh? I mean, I'm pretty sure it's point based, but, you know. I'm lucky to even be getting enough points to get uh, another life. Okay. Ugh. These jumps are a nightmare. If you cannot correct the jump, mid jump. Nah! Crud! Uh, I don't want to jump on these platforms because I'm afraid of falling off, but I probably could have attacked with uh, Miriam. And would have been fine. Throw a knife at the bat. Like that. Screw you two. <laughs> I both are at full health. Uh, 
I'm also kind of afraid of Miriam's way higher jump here on these platforms. That can make it real easy to over jump there. Either way, we made it with two characters alive. And really, I probably would have been better off taking the long path. <laughs> So much for long path. Do I need um no probably not. It does kind of look like it would open and it's the right color for I mean it, it is a door. Maybe you can go through it from the other side apparently? Like here you could go through the left as well, so I don't know. That is a life extension indeed. And both characters got it apparently. Nice. Uh, I want the axe. I'll take that as well. Oh god, Medusa! <laughs> Why? Although they're not as uh, frequently appearing as Medusa hats. Uh, I want to try my luck again. That is the other axe, isn't it? The super slow one. I will not take that. Forget it! Get with money, Golem. Sort of. Please don't crush me. I mean, he's certainly trying. Oh my god, that is, that takes a lot of uh, weapon energy. But oh, oh, what am I supposed to do? Oh, <laughs> interesting. Oh, nice! You can hit with all your your daggers. Ooh. I just wanted to say, I think that's the first time I actually have to fight that uh, giant golem dude. <laughs> and yeah, thank goodness you can actually destroy these platforms here with um, attacking them, because otherwise, if you don't have Miriam, you would just die. Yeah, you can't be hit by that. Good to know. Nice! I like that boss, that was fun. Ooh, nice, and your characters get revived too, huh? So who are we recruiting now? It's Alucard! Jibble, isn't that the uh, the big bad in Ritual of the Night? Also, uh, I mean, I, I was halfway joking with Alucard, but I think I'm not far. I'm definitely not far off. <laughs> I'll take it though. <laughs> oh wow! That is some pathway. <laughs> it just goes straight, is what you're telling me. Wow, enemies. Like, walking enemies that take more than one hit. I'm sorry, slow walking enemies that take more than. Actually, we've had those. Ah, whatever. <laughs> Never mind me. <laughs> I'll take that. And now, looking at it lying on the ground, it's more like a scythe 
than it is an axe. Miriam, do you have any relation to somebody called Death? Either way, I can't help but feel that Miriam is the best character out of these four here. Uh, at least, as far as I've tried them. I mean, she has insane range, even if her attack suffers a little from that. Her sub-weapons are more fun. Uh, sure, let's take a shortcut this time. Actually, what I just... I will fall down if I don't transform into a bat. Whip! Wait, how much health do you have? Uh, as much as Miriam, I think. Mm. Nope, slightly less. Okay. I oops. had to take a look at my weapons there for a second. Uh, just points. Having four different sub weapons is insane. <laughs> so much versatility. Something for every occasion. Yeah. <laughs> Such insane range. I love it. Oh. Gotta be careful, though, that we don't lose her. Also, no, I, I don't know either when I say we and when I say I. I it just comes out as it does. <laughs> There's no rhyme or reason to it, is what I'm saying. So I can just uh, take that path, or I can... Yeah, no, that path seems a lot... <laughs> a lot easier. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. Mm. Ah, oh dear. What are you going to do? Are we just shooting forward or? It's doing nothing good. Um. I think I want to keep my bat if he he probably has other ooh, sub weapons too, but I think bat would be the best sub weapon out of all. Uh, sure. Let's see if I can get your giant sword. I did. Please don't kill me. Thank you. Also, can you jump backward? Like, yeah, you can. Huh. Sweet. I'll take that. Probably won't take that though. Uh, I'll take it. Good. Didn't think you could jump back there. Uh, I'm probably going to regret that, but let's see. Yeah, I probably have to fly over him with a bat, now that I'm thinking about it. But I don't think I have enough. What is your weapon? Uh, just the bat. Okay, how much do you need? Crap. <laughs> Too much is the answer. So, ah, and I gave away my, all, all of my sub weapon points to begin with, so it doesn't even matter that I don't have my whip anymore. Die, Fleeman! You don't belong the, really? Really? <laughs> ah, stop it! Stop dropping them on stuff where I can uh, hit them. I'll keep my sight. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's probably just where you would have gotten out of had you not taken. Uh, well, there probably would have been another screen or something, but you know. 
Uh, yeah, sure. Let's let's just kill that thing. That's probably also an alternate path, I would assume. Um, let's take a look at what's inside uh, here for Jibal. I'll take it. So that is the Gibalt par path, and if you don't have them, you have to go down. Okay. Interesting, certainly. And to the right is probably the altered path if you couldn't take him. That goes through, and I think I should uh, have some whip for attacking. Ah, words. That seems like a wise idea. As much as I like the... I think it's uh, it's a talisman, like a, a paper talisman, like in... Uh, like Rayma has. <laughs> I don't have enough weapon energy. Yeah. Dodging on stairs. Every castle when you play is nightmare. <laughs> ah, missed him. Oh wow, I'm short on life. That's fine, it seems. Most of these guys go down fairly quickly. Like, I don't think there's a single enemy that has more than two hits. I think I'm good with my weapon setup, so let's just get... Yeah. Apparently, if you have Jibel, he'll just get five energy from that. Actually, I don't even need Jibel to get through that, uh, to that. There we go. Nice! Multiple options, I like it. Oh. <laughs> For some reason I thought going to the right here is the intended path, or the path to move forward. Um... Oh, you can transform him to jump, that's nice, that is nice indeed. Can I just jump over there? No? Okay. Frogs! Yeah, all frogs need to die. Mercilessly. Yes, that includes froggy, big. I'm, I'm not even sorry. I don't know, I don't really need to kill these candles, but, uh, eh. I want to. I'm not using Jibble for the fight anyway. <laughs> Probably. Like I said, I think I'm fine with a setup here, so... Great. Another one-up? They are really generous. Not that I'm complaining, I'm just surprised. Guess I'll take another look for you. No, that's just the fire wheel. Don't know how effective it is if you don't kill your enemy in one hit. That said, I'm not effective how it would be in uh, how anything I have is effective against that thing. Oh dear. It has multiple heads. Ha! I mean, uh oh. I do appreciate the fact the fire is fairly slow, though. Like, I would have assumed that the fire is gonna hit you as soon as, uh, nice. As soon as he, uh, opens its, its mouth there. Oh, cool, you can destroy the projectiles. Interesting. Can I even jump as far as I need to? No. Oh, okay. So they're going to switch their attacks eventually, or was it just because it took so long? You have most of the points. <laughs> oh. Oh! He 
dodged my weapon! Uh-oh. Yeah, something like that is what I expected. <laughs> hey! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! He only had two hits left. Uh, okay, so do I have to restart the entire boss battle now? Because if you do, that means the first time you die, you're just you're just screwed because you're probably going to use up all your weapon energy. And, um... And you're gonna have a lot less life left. Oh, that is dumb. And of course, if you're dumb enough to get hit by enemies on your way to the boss again, then um, that's your own fault. <laughs> uh, yeah, that is pretty bad. Hmm. I don't really like that kind of design. That is some insane rage that explosion has there. Also, sliding takes a long time to recover. Yeah, I think I'll just uh, keep... Okay, they uh, don't even just alternate, they can just use whatever they want. Nice. Unfortunately, it does not hit itself. Nice. That's interesting to know, too, that you can just, uh, destroy the, their attack while it's still in their mouth. God, your range is pathetic, dude. Get up! But at least you can swing fast. Since you don't have too much room to begin with here, might as well go fast. So is that the entire second phase of the boss? So far it seems like it. Yeah, <laughs> that was literally it. Huh. Seems kind of disappointing. What do you mean, no revenge attack this time around? Oh well. I mean, not that I'm disappointed, I'm just surprised. Oh hey, a ship! This... I mean, sure, I know it's a prequel game, but is this... Uh, right? Like, this, the, uh, the... Yeah? Apparently, Ritual of the Night, uh, takes place right after this game, since these enemies are in the demo of Ritual of the Night as well. Heck, I think the song here is the same as in Ritual of the Night. Alright, oh, the mimics. Let's grab that with the jewel so we get some weapon energy. Now, I think I'm really fine with my current weapon setup. There only seem to be three weapons, uh, three weapons for every character. Except for Jibal, who just gets uh, weapon energy. Yeah, shortcut. Or not a shortcut, but just uh, one up and an enemy. It seems 
way less threatening than it should be. <laughs> wow. I didn't even need that much. Uh, sure, let's grab that one up, I guess. So it is to be noted that Jubal doesn't just fly in a straight way. Like, he always either ascends or descends. Like, he descends automatically, but the only way to negate that is by pressing up. That's what I- Ah, fuck! Well, I have that now. What is your deal? Okay. Is that all it can do? Ah, seems like it. Nah. Well, it's better than the uh, yaks. But I preferably would get my scythe back. Oh well, I screwed up. Everybody's at full life, too. Neat. That should be a boss. <laughs> Judging from that door there. Oh my. Picture. Um, well. I wouldn't even describe that a mini boss except for the framing. No pun intended. Nice. I don't know, it feels kind of cheap going through all these shortcuts. <laughs> Okay, so this is not a foolproof tactic of dealing with these guys. I'll take that. <laughs> I thought I was dead there. And I don't have I don't actually have anything to attack downward, huh? Rud. Eh. I can do that still. Nothing wanna. Oh. Eh, I mean. I will you attacking up more than down. Not the character meant to switch to, but I'll take it. <laughs> Speaking of, I'll take it. So are you just completely useless against the power of Jebel? I'll take that as a yes. Oh, we're being pushed back to the right slightly. Ugh. That said, don't mind if I do. Only after getting hit, of course. Uh, is down a pathway or a death? I'm not certain, and I'm kind of afraid. Oops. And pressing the wrong buttons. I always hate wind mechanics in games. They always screw with you way too much.
Especially in a game that is as stiff as the classic Castlevania games, where you can't even, uh... That is just death, isn't it? I mean, another way it would be before. Uh, even I don't know what I want to say. It, it, otherwise, it would have been uh, a staircase, like here. I really don't want to jump with this wind going on here. Fuck it, I'm flying. <laughs> that was kind of scary. Ugh. Not a fan, definitely. Also, that might be like so. No, nope, just points. Well, points will eventually transform into a life. How does that lamp up there work? Thanks for not knocking me into the pit, though. Um. I'm guessing that is the ultimate magic for one character. I, I don't know. I also don't know why I came here to pick that up when I was already at full without trying out the ultimate magic. It seemed like a dumb move, to be honest. I wonder if everybody or anybody could have picked that up. Also, I really should stop picking up the, the MP without trying out that move. That does seem useful. That does seem like a boss battle, too. So, who are you? Okay. Don't mind if I do. Oh. Okay. I really should be careful not to spend all of my MP on nothing and I'm dying. Like I almost did. But I do wonder if these attacks will go away if I switch my character. I don't even care. <laughs> I just want to live! That's fine, I think. Wow. And I just forgot that wind is always active here, no matter what, anyway. Ugh. Oh, wow! Okay, I guess you have to duck to avoid most of that, but you'll still be knocked back, sort of. God, wind mechanics, why? No, he just wants that attack this time. Ugh. I did something. This isn't even his final form! Wow. I hope nobody here is, uh... Epilepsy. Oh, good to know. Uh, uh, that, that was it? <laughs> it was just another revenge attack! <laughs> Get down with game! <laughs> Okay. I'll take it, everybody is alive. I 
this appears to be the final stage. Oh uh, yeah, you can keep your your amazing weapon. Seems fine. Ugh. Old familiar friends. Oh, he just completely blocks all weapons that don't penetrate his shield. Okay. I mean, it makes sense. It is a shield after all. This spore, though, um, might be annoying on stairs. Then again, what isn't? Might also be annoying if your aim is as crappy as mine. <laughs> Ooh, another ultimate spell and uh, whatever that down there is. I like my uh, scythe too much. I'm gonna keep it. Oh, only the old dude can pick it up, huh? So it is specifically for him. Interesting. Now, what is that? I don't know. Also, I'm assuming that to the left there is lava, so I'm not going to uh, go there. Forget it. Yeah, I'm just gonna ignore you. Actually, up is probably the better path. I don't. Re I didn't memorize the map, so I'm not entirely sure. Down here is not even a path. Down here is a way to cheese this boss with uh, this. It's enemy though. <laughs> the bats even go high enough. Actually, do I even need the whip then? Huh. Well, that's my answer to that question. The less sub weapon I need, uh, sub weapons I need, the better. Got to keep it for the bosses and for the scythe. What do you mean that it's not breakable? Huh? He is pointing to the right. So, oh. Let's not pick that up first. Okay. That was weird. I somehow apparently jumped off the stairs there. Actually, you can't switch in midair. Like, you can't switch your characters in midair, so you could probably just, uh, like, Jump, realize you're not making it, and then transform. Yes, you can. Wow. Assume you can react fast enough. Uh -oh. Speaking of reacting fast enough, this seems like a job for Jabal. Five points. Uh oh. Eh, fine enough. I don't think I'm gonna use Jabel too much in the boss battle. I don't even want to touch that. Uh oh. Okay, you can change directions. I thought I was stuck with the, the only way to go was into the lava. Oh, that... The seam doesn't even, uh... Break or jump. That's good. Wait, you take three hits? Wow!
Oh, what? How did it get to seven lives? <laughs> I thought this game was supposed to be, uh, like, I guess it's a normal difficulty. Because everything else was locked. Oh, wow, that seems cruel. Putting those poor creatures into the Iron Maiden. Speaking of one-ups, though... Wait, why are you just shaking without opening or anything? Ah. I was expecting something along the lines of that. Uh, nothing else is shaking, so... Is that a bunny girl? <laughs> a bunny girl with a demon's tail. Perfect. The ultimate demon! Oh, wow! <laughs> okay, I I'll stop making fun of you. You're apparently way more successful at doing your job than anybody else before you was. <laughs> uh, how to deal with those? Like, I'm, I'm not used to deal with attacks from above. Jabel, do you know what to do against those? Yeah, he does. Sort of. Yeah. I meant to press a uh, sub weapon and press character switch. Well, <laughs> that went well. I probably won't be needing the uh, the titular character for the boss battle, right? Probably not. I don't need the tank. Uh. Oh hey, Bats. Haven't seen you in a while. Now I actually have somebody who's good against you too. That sort of worked. <laughs> but I'm just gonna assume that that is the way to deal with those. Uh... Oh wow. With those fast shot dudes. How did I deal with you the first time? I'd like to know. And I'm really missing my tank now. Didn't help that he died at full health, too. I see you have a, uh, a cross of your own. Okay, does not change lanes, though. That's good. Ow. Um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna refill all of my life, huh? Wasn't there a room like this in one of the castle wingers, too? Where it was just one dude backing off into another dude who all just threw uh, axes at you. That room was way longer though. I mean, the, uh, the original Castlevania game. Also, really hope dudes don't respawn, otherwise I have made a terrible mistake. Uh, that doesn't seem like it though. That you, Bloody Mary? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it might be. I don't know who the final boss is. <laughs> okay. So I need to transform these into stairs. So I can attack the boss. Okay, there are stairs to begin with, but I probably don't want them moving. Can they hurt me if they hit me, though? Oh, that's interesting. Aw, oh, don't destroy your own umbrellas. No, that was not a tell for her attack from last time. Ooh, I thought I had more health left than that. Also, nice flying abilities you have there, Miriam. Oh no, <laughs> I only have the old dude left. I'm gonna die. 
Okay, correction. I'm not even gonna make it to the boss. <laughs> Well, it's good to know that a cane can destroy, uh, hammers, though. Haha, <laughs> you cannot back off any further! What are you gonna do now? I was expecting that dude to walk into me and, uh, deal damage that way, but, uh, I'll take it. So, I'm not gonna make it far in this boss battle here. Definitely. You can't even hit her from down here. Don't even ask me why I'm still trying to. Uh oh, that's the. Yeah. I mean, I, I only have seven more lives left. Should be doable. Oh no! Rud. Um, I need another weapon for you, definitely. I'll take it, I guess. <laughs> I really have to be careful not to die before I get into the boss. Like last time! <laughs> Yeah, I want to get the scythe, thank you. Why didn't the stairs... work? Well, you know what that means. Taking a full reset here. I mean, I have the life to spare. That was just bad. So let's try this again also. Do the weapons actually upgrade or, or was it just coincidence? Like, do I have to take these knives here or, or not? That's the question. This time, let's actually go up the staff. Ah, fuck. Let's go the long way, because I don't have enough weapon energy for... Eh, I mean... Now I do. Hmm. Need to go back a little bit further still. But alright. Probably need either a sub weapon or I have to uh, swing in. I think the retracting the whip takes too long though to switch to him and uh. Actually, how does. No? Okay, so landing does not cancel out your weapon attack. Don't mind me getting some sub weapon energy here. Also, don't mind me walking those stairs, I totally intended that. Something. Uh, yeah, sure, let's switch to somebody who can attack faster. Seems like I'll need that. Seems like I'm doing a terrible job all, all of a sudden. Even the old man is better than all of us to combined. Uh... Eh? Let's see how this goes. Probably should just stay on the second level there, as long as I can. It's easier to dodge that way, uh, I mean...
Oh. I expected her to use the, uh... Rain... the bloody rain attack. I was kind of off with that assumption, though. Okay, so the lowest umbrella does not protect against the bloody rain. That's also good to know. Yeah, but it makes sense, it's barely off the ground. Barely higher than you. Could have been worse, could have been better. Okay, form time. Okay. How are you? Uh, I guess I beat the boss and she's just. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, that, that's not it. At all. Maybe I did! I, I'm assuming I was supposed to hit the face that boss there that I didn't see. <laughs> Until well, the very end. To uh, protect against that damage, but, um. Nice. Oh, so that castle is a lot bigger than I expected. What do you mean the vampire, like, dude, it's not the final boss? Couldn't be. God, I'm doing awful now. <laughs> I'm supposed to be get a bow. Yeah, I'm supposed to get better near the end, not worse. Oh, that's the duplicate uh, spell. Well, so I'm terribly afraid of going there. Nah. Actually! <laughs> nice! That seems kind of unfair, but I, I, I don't care. I'm totally fine with that. Uh, sure, let's let's just skip you. Oops. Um. Well, <laughs> there goes my safety. There goes my life, <laughs> or Jabels anyway. Eh, I might get to another checkpoint or so. Before I'm doomed. Okay, is that always the s- No, it, uh, it might cycle through or something, I don't know. I also don't know which is actually the weapon I want here. I just know that I want to, uh, that guy destroyed, but... I don't know if I want to sacrifice more of my characters for that. I mean, I'm trying, apparently. Or not. Too risky. Um, I mean, that could be. Eh. Fuck it, I'm off. <laughs> Ooh, armor. So, am I now taking less damage? What happened? Um. Okay, it doesn't move. I was afraid it would uh, come after me and try to kill me. Yeah, let's just ignore that, I guess. Yeah, I'm fine with an upwards attack, especially now that I don't have Chabelle anymore. Pfft. Wow, he, he, he... Alfred really should be hitting that, but apparently... It's not. Even though the Switten went through the candle. I could go up there without... Uh, I guess that means I'll have to... Ah, oh, and up there is the ultimate magic, too! Nah, let's not take that. If it is what it, I think it is, like the... Okay, I, um... Oh, no.
Now the funny part is, I have three more tries to uh, get this one up. And even if I died here just now, I would have traded off one or more lives against uh, four lives, basically. The four characters, anyway. Never trust stairs. <laughs> Get down these stairs! Why do they never work? Oh, well, what? Oh, wow, you have to make a really long jump there. I think I'm even gonna use Miriam for that. Just so I have a longer... A higher jump, really. What a weird DM! Yeah, and... Oh, some more floating uh, weapon energy. Uh-oh. That dealt with that. <laughs> it's kind of amazing how it can just freeze anything. And then kill it with the next hit. Uh, okay, whoever gets hit next is dead. Maybe not. Oh wait, can you deal with that guy that way? Yes you can. Nice. I hope this is gonna be my checkpoint. <laughs> of course I'll need one. For obvious reasons. <laughs> oh, I can't even hit them. Uh-oh. Ah, that's a mini-boss at least. It's another painting, it seems like. It certainly is. I mean, I have my holy cross! So I'm fine. Maybe not. <laughs> Help! Wow. I can't believe I actually <laughs> made it through that without getting hit. Because I'm kind of sorry for this. Many bosses mute to be frozen. <laughs> I'm telling you, the Holy Cross is the best sub weapon in the entire game. Even when it's not a Holy Cross. I'm fine with my weapon loadout, except I won't be keeping it for long. I'll definitely not keep it for long, unless this is life. Well, goodbye, you two! Oh shit. I hope I didn't miss any life down there. <laughs> uh, okay. I don't think I want to fight that. I kind of fear that I have to, though. Actually, I think freezing it would be faster and way more efficient. Eh. How do I get across there? Like, I cannot jump that high even. Probably need a bell. Maybe I have to tag with a sub web to destroy it. I don't know. That said, how am I still alive? <laughs> it's a secret to everyone. Good. I just wanted to test if that kills me or if I just drop down. I mean, while I'm that low on health anyway, might as well try out some stuff, right? Please be health inside there. Actually, if there's health inside, that just means that that was small health, so no boss coming up right away. Hopefully. Okay, so that... 
guys, Axis don't come back, that's good. And with the range I have, I can just keep swinging if I stay away. Like, my, my weapon attack would be fast enough to destroy his flying axis. Yeah, it's another way there, I assume. Do I want Miriam with her higher jump or not? Mm. I don't know why I jumped there. <laughs> <laughs> I even thought, yeah, if I jump here, I'm gonna die. And I did it anyway. <laughs> uh oh. Down there, okay. <gasps> Why is your attack rage so shitty? You got a mage? <laughs> and he's dead. <laughs> I mean, I only have seven more lives. It, it could be, it could be getting close. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, that's a fair point too. Man, I got the scythe immediately. Nice. Um. Yeah, I think I could do this just uh, by using my characters. Like, I don't need to fly here to stay alive. Hopefully. I am just going to kill that fairy, though. Too afraid of getting knocked down by it. I mean, it would not be a first time, would it? Die. Oh, that guy again. Okay, the skeleton dude is telling me to go up. But the room is telling me to go to the left. Either way, going up seems to be the more difficult part. Hidden passage! Nice. Yeah, that just gives me a lot of uh, points. Always check for more hidden passages than a hidden passage. I mean, it wouldn't be the first time that a castle when a game has done something like that. <laughs> Not sure about classic Castlevania though. Yeah, let's try our luck. The producer hats are efficient as always. I'm assuming the yellow to the path would have been way longer, <laughs> judging by that health gain there. Alright, I can just get five more weapon energy with Jabel here. Sweet! Ow. Stupid stairs, I wanted to duck and attack. I'm telling you, stairs are the worst enemy. <laughs> Could have even done it uh, without ducking, but uh, yeah, now I get scared, <laughs> and I'm not taking those knives. Forget it. You know, I'm not totally sure if the weapon sub weapons here are placed by the designers or if they are random. Still not certain by it. Uh, certain of it. Okay, that's certainly a demon. Oh no. Oh no. Uh-oh. Well, that's anime as fuck! <laughs> wow. 
Also, he's vulnerable, vulnerable as fuck if he uh, just does that. Uh oh, dodge. <laughs> Perfect landing there. Uh, now you have enough life. The benefits of having a tank. Wow! Was that it? That, that couldn't have been it, right? That certainly hurt, but I don't care. Yeah. Huh. Well. That was surprisingly easy! <laughs> and a back to eight health! Uh, life's I mean. <laughs> okay, that has to be the final boss there, right? I mean, we don't even know the path to take there. And I mean, with a name like that, Curse the Moon, that has to be the final boss battle. I mean, the final stage. Where do the characters have a... No. Must have been imagining things. Okay, let's do this! I may or may not be scared. <laughs> yeah, that, um... Nice jumping on that, dude. Also, nice remembering that I have a bad form. Can you jump on? Oops. I mean, does it even matter? I'm gonna need my life, huh? <laughs> I'm kind of afraid of just falling down, but uh, I'm fearing that going down the stairs will not be fast enough. And if you remember exactly where the platform was at the very bottom, you could even just fall down there. I see if you have enough uh, mid-air control. But you probably don't. Almost got him. Yeah, except he has more than two bats worth of life. Speaking of life... Yeah, whatever the, uh, that stream of whatever it is, uh, I don't like it. <laughs> it, go, it can go straight to hell. It's basically a noob trap. If you don't know where to go, you... I mean, you... STAIRS! <laughs> you have enough time to move out of the way, but not by much. Is that ever going to end? I'm going to assume no. There probably was a time thing, like you could probably destroy the wall yourself, and uh, if you're fast enough, you can go there. For that, or you can go there now. No, not fast enough. Either that, or it's trigger based. I'm fine with the with the ice. You know, the eyes is pretty good. <laughs> That's two enemies there. And a really tough boss. Uh, not boss, but enemy. Wow! 
That's kind of ridiculous. I mean, sure, uh... This old man here has nothing outside of the spells, but still. I'm dead. Yeah, you, you cannot outrun this if you ever get hit once. And I don't think there is a fast enough character there either. Now what I want to know is, do lives respawn? Also, transforming takes some time. Uh-oh. <laughs> I may have made a mistake! Eh, just a little. Okay, do lives respawn if all your characters have died? That's the good question now. Hmm. Okay, Miriam should be able to take that. Ooh, Scythe, nice. Yep, the life respawns. I'm dead anyway. <laughs> Old man! I don't have enough. Bad power, yeah. Uh, I was trying to get to Greedy. Now I definitely can't get up there anymore. Uh, sure, old man. Get the good weapon. Oh god! It just starts! Ah, life. Ah, I'm dead. <laughs> you know, I, I could just do an infinite loop here. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna, uh, going to do that because I wanted to take the upper path. Alleyup. Yeah, it would be kind of broken if you ca uh, could recollect your uh, the 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 one ups every time you your character dies. Like you could get four lives. That would be ridiculous. What was that about uh, transformation taking time? Well, you are kind of fast. So. Not fast enough though, no. Well, it goes away! <laughs> I should not be alive. <laughs> I should not be given this, hi uh, this life here. This health. I'm afraid. I need short tops, so... Uh, I also do not need to attack at anything. If I try to do that, I should use Jabel. I'm assuming I can reset this knot. Um, I guess I was supposed to die there? I mean, if you have enough weapon energy, you could go up there technically, but I don't. So let's get rid of the most useless character first. <laughs> or something. Okay, he does stop too. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not allowed to take anything if I want to live. Let the tank deal this. I think he has the fastest attack, but I don't want to risk dying again. Also, I probably shouldn't take the long path. <laughs> that probably helps too. I'm fine with my weapons, I just need a lot more energy for them. Oh wow. That's basically a demon from <laughs> the Castlevania games. Did I kill it? I think I did. Yeah, what uh, stairs sometimes just don't react to you jumping at them. Weird. Ah, crud. I don't have the knives. I am uh, kind of screwed too. Too many Adam. Oh my god. What is this? Who said we need more Fleeman? <laughs> crud. Oh no, don't tell me that the next room is the final boss room, because that would mean that oh shit. Um, that I would have to do this every time I try to get a 
hit it in on the final boss. Ooh, yeah, that is terrible. Ooh, I don't like that room. Wow. That is a difficulty spike. If I've ever seen one. Oh, wow. I, what? Wait! Oh, I guess I'm uh, getting infinite lives. <laughs> I guess I'm fine with that part of, of this. Oh right, there was some life here immediately. Okay, let's try and remember to take the short path. The short path requires Miriam, right. Meh. Fine enough still. Yeah, weapon loadout. Well, I mean, he could use some some magic, some better one. But I think I just need magic is useless if I can't even make use of it. Oops. Magic is also useless if you just miss with it. But that's another story entirely. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, that was dumb. Yeah, let's see if I can get through there somehow. I'll take it! Even if it means that I barely have any weapons for the... Not even boss. I don't think I have enough energy for that, though. Now I do. Hold on. That seems fishy. I think just giving you a one-up for no apparent reason. Like from here, I would assume a one. Oh, a way to get back, nice. Thanks, guys. And the ultimate magic again. Okay, five is not enough though to get back. You need seven. Okay, it is the platform for the final boss. Well, what I assume to be the final boss anyway. But we, we've had enough boss battles to, for that to be the final one. What are you doing? I'm afraid. Ah! Fuck you! That's all I have to say to that. Um. Fuck you and uh, die in hell, please. So are these things even going? Uh, yeah, they are going different patterns. And they're probably pretty determined by which animation is being used. Well, it's definitely the final boss. I mean, the final boss never has just one form. Then again, regular bosses sometimes have multiple forms too, but that is very final boss-ish. 
I mean, it even has instant death pits. <laughs> that that seems cool. Uh, how am I hitting you, though? I would like to know that. Oh god. Okay, I can destroy those. That's good. Okay, sub weapons. The game just said as much. Or, or not. Okay, those good platforms. Interesting. Also, somebody's dead. Uh oh. Wait, they, they put a 1-up here, though. Meaning I'm in, a, in another life cycle. Why would you do that? For the final boss, no less. I mean, not that I needed this one extra life. I mean, I'm a, I would have been a 10 either way. <laughs> now I'm an 11. So, how does this pattern go? That! Okay. Uh, that seems like down. I don't know what goes down there. Huh. Okay. Left up. Uh, I mean, right up or... Yeah, like, like that. Attack to the right, my dears. Attack to the left, so uh, let's go right and uh, die in the process. I'm doing way worse than last time. Okay, this time it wants to go up, so let's hide down. Or maybe not. Maybe this meant uh, ignore the center or, or something. <laughs> So I'm assuming we cannot do anything in this phase here. I do not want to keep using Miriam because she's about to be dead. One more hit will probably do her in. So I think the sentry is actually the safest part. Outside of here. So what am I supposed to do here? Supposed to attack something. Uh, okay. So apparently, if I jump high enough, I'm immune to that, or was it because I attacked the the moon? Also, what are you supposed to do if you don't have any sub weapons that have range? Oh, I mean, you, you probably have sub weapons that have range. I mean, yeah, you, you have you have this dude. What are you doing? Why? Are you moved to that? Huh. But I've lost the ultimate magic, so either way, uh... I done goofed? Uh, okay. That's... oh. I just wanted to say, that's a different moon from last time, and uh, it shows. I'm terribly afraid of it. I'm coming back. Yeah, they, they do. Oh boy. Huh. 
Okay, apparently with the whip you can only attack. Oh dear. It can only hit the moon if you're already in the jump. Ugh. Either way, I'm probably going to die. <laughs> okay, the old man still has some hit points. And that's honestly better than anything else. Like, any than anybody else has. Oh, now you give me... Wasn't centered. Ah! Wasn't dodging. <laughs> oh. mm. You kind of need to tr destroy those sickles if you want to have any. Uh, any magic points, unfortunately. Oh yeah, no, there's this way. Shit. <laughs> okay, so if you're high enough, the... the energy just doesn't hit you. That's good to know. Oh boy. Oh, nice! Nice, they, they have pity on me. I got hit anyway. Okay, I have up to two more hits. I'm not allowed to take. And yeah, no matter what you say, the the knives are not better than the Holy Cross, than the Holy Sickle, Holy Scythe. I mean, of course. Please don't use. Nah, that that is yeah. That's the blood sickles. I mean, sure, I can just dodge all of them. Or die trying. And dying is definitely what I will. Who? Uh, that's a final boss battle. Wee. <laughs> you bastards! <laughs> uh, okay, so <laughs> you actually have to jump. Oh, fall though. Just yeah, that that's enough. Wow, that's kind of funny. Um. Back there was just the ultimate magic. Just the ultimate magic, you know? Alright, oh, I don't actually need any of that. I'm still going to fly up here because I'm kind of paranoid on uh, <laughs> falling down anyway. So is that still. Yeah, uh, you have an infinite life loop here. The hell? Nope. I don't know, just an infinite life loop at the very end of the game. Why? I mean, I, I, I'm grateful. I think. It's just weird. Like, what kind of game would ever do that? Okay, that means attack downward, I think. Uh-oh. That means attack upward, so hide in the center. I'll take it.
Oh, I think I've been called, uh, just a second. If I ever can get escape here. So apparently you're not allowed to pause in the final boss battle, that, no, that's nice, or I don't know which button that is, uh... So, uh, I, I guess I'll just try to beat this battle here then, or, or something. That is dumb. <laughs> also, like, I know you can see my cursor. <laughs> that might take a while now. Like, so far escape worked as a means to pause the game. So why not now? Nothing else works. That is... Weird. Yeah, no, no button reacts to, to pausing. Uh, well. I guess I'll, I'll try to finish this quick then. Also being heavily damaged because I tried to pause and no, no button worked. Maybe it's a problem with Linux? I, like... That the wine that wine doesn't emulate the pausing. Pro no, that doesn't make any sense at all whatsoever. Why would they ever give you that? That that seems dumb. Like we're giving you the ultimate magic, but uh, yeah, we're taking it away too. Plus, I probably should take somebody else for tanking. Seems unwise to use your best character for tanking, eh? That's why I say she's the best character. Like, even if you're terrible at... Okay, that, that's just really bad now. Okay, she's out. <laughs> Due to my own uh, bad play. Okay. So... Wow. Well, I got an achievement, that seems to be it. <laughs> and you can even see the achievement, I just realized, huh? Me. <laughs> no! Sengetsu! Who was astonished by his own actions? He existed to slay demons and take revenge, but long lost emotions had been rekindled. However, something or other. <laughs> well, there he goes. Poor guy. And so, in order to stop the new Dark Emperor, Sagatsu's allies plunged into battle again. They may have to end their allies' life, but can they still save a soul? Oh, Sengetsu was the, the, the big bad of, the, uh, of Ritual of the Night. I don't remember. But it seems like it. I haven't actually followed too much of the development of uh, Bloodstained, only what they showed on their uh, YouTube channel. They haven't showed... Uh, well, they, they have updated stuff, but not like story-related stuff. At least not in a while. Either way, I think the game is... Does it have a release date? I don't I don't think it has. I think at, at best they said something like end of 2018 or something. Either way, this game was fun, even though a little easy. Like, you, you just saw me destroy that final boss. Even though for the first uh, couple bits I lost like half the health of Miriam. Because I tried to boss the game and it didn't work. I don't know. Anyway... I have to go now. I hope there's nothing coming up to the credits. Because I cannot stay to see that. Well, it'll probably unlock some stuff. Hmm. Um, yeah, I also can skip the credits, so I hope they're all 
quick because I really need to go. <laughs> uh, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hope it as great of a time as I had playing this because this game is awesome. If you haven't gotten it already through backing the game, definitely get it. I, you probably can get it on Steam normal as well now. So I don't know how much it costs, and it works on Linux too. Like the only thing that doesn't work on Linux apparently is um, if you do pause the game, the uh, the the the, uh, the the exit window there doesn't have any text, so there's a 50-50 chance of you exiting the game. <laughs> Hint! The exit button's to the right. But yeah, that, that must be a problem with wine, I'm assuming. Because that probably would have been caught uh, playtesting. Nightmare mode has been unlocked, I'm assuming that's a higher difficulty. I'm just gonna check that and then I'll be gone, because as I said, I need to go. <laughs> so yeah, thanks for watching, and... There's another, more harder difficulty, apparently. Yeah, see, ex uh, escape now goes back. That, that, that's so weird. Anyway, thanks for watching again for the third time, and see you next time!